Uh, hello everyone, we got something a little different today. It's WooTBM, but I'm here with my wife, Moo. Hello! Yeah, doing things different because Tony's out and I figured, why not? Especially since we got this uh, survival game and I think Moo is probably the best experience between the three of us in survival games. Yeah, I love playing survival games, so... Yeah, give the game the best shot it deserves. I don't think there's much more to say about this game. You want to just jump into it? Sure. So I just go right. new game. Is this a keyboard? Um, I think there's a lot of mouse controls. Okay. Okay, cool, cool, cool. What's happening? Okay. I'm on I'm in space. Okay. You are in space. Oh, and it's your job to survive. Okay. This is cute. This is cute art. Yeah. I think uh, this is stock S. It's of oh. some sort. Okay. Am I moving with okay, I'm moving with arrows. You are naked. <laughs> I am naked. Oh god. Okay, wait, wait, wait. What am I doing? Uh, uh you probably have to press space bar to click to interact oh, with things. Oh, there you go. Okay. I should not sleep now. Okay. Yes. Why aren't we sleeping? Cuz you're awake now. What? <laughs> it's nighttime. Oh wait, we're in space. It's always nighttime. Always night. I'll put on my magnetic boots. Okay. It's also good this? to have you play because you can give this dev a good look at uh, how someone who's not played RPG Maker games interacts with their game. Yeah. And tries, and tries to figure things out. Yeah, I was like, I I didn't think about pressing spacebar until you said it. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> I kept trying to like click with the mouse. Um, wait, she's like fully naked. I think so. Those look like nip nips. <laughs> yeah. <her> titties. <laughs> I think it's low enough resolution that we're okay. I'm pretty sure. Okay. Uh, I think yeah, so. It's, yeah. I kind I kind of think maybe it's a little unprofessional for her to sleep naked. She should probably be, wear, be wearing like a sports bra or something in bed. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, like if there's an emergency, she's gonna run out there butt naked. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I think the idea is you're alone in space, but like, I don't know. <laughs> okay, um, so let's see. Uh, I should clean this up. Okay, so let's clean it up. I should clean this up. Okay. Okay, I don't. All right, I guess I don't clean it up. <laughs> okay, it just stays there. Investigate the alarm. So it's... you probably need to click on one of these computers, maybe. Uh, let's see. This computer, no power. Oh, power. oh no. Oh god, no power. Okay, so. Um. Yeah, try going to your oh. locker there. Oh, here we go. Locker. Okay. Do I? Hey. Wait, did I collect that? Maybe. Oh, yeah, take. Take, take everything. Details, space helmet, armor, plus two. Oh, you need, you have armor. I didn't realize there, I actually didn't know that there was combat in this game. Oh, no. Okay. I didn't mean what that was. Okay, that's money. Yeah, I'm not sure why you have money, but sure. Okay. So oh, now no. you can get dressed at least. Oh, I kept that open. Oh, uh, did I just, oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, good old fashioned book. Uh huh. <laughs> oh, is this the door? Oh, 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 okay. I thought it was disconnected. I should check the alarm first. No, let me go where I want to go. <laughs> ah, where is the alarm? No. Is it down here? That looks like a kitchen. The ship has no power. Okay, so are these other doors opening then? Good question. There we go. Okay. This looks like a bridge. Okay, rebooting. Rebooting. Uh, I think you need to press spacebar again. Oh, okay. <laughs> Why are we running on emergency power? Okay. When is the power coming back online? Well, I don't know. Power is coming back online now. Are you sure? This was not how I wanted to wake up. You mean butt naked? Ah, well, I'm glad we're back to normal. Are we? We're still butt naked. Normal is not the word I would use. Me either. <laughs> how so? We have lost our navigational heading. Okay. Wait, what? Navigation shows errors. No recognizable points in the vicinity. Okay. Well, do a scan of our surroundings then. Yeah, computer. 
God. Scanning. Scanning complete. And... Scanning upgrades necessary. Unable to determine our location at the moment. Okay, so we're lost. Thanks. Lost in space. Ah! What are you saying? That we're lost! <laughs> Emergency protocol activated. What do you mean? Well, wait a minute. Okay. The best course of action will be as followed. We just jump off the ship. Fuck it. Oh, I can't say that. Can I? What did you say? Jack <laughs> off the ship? <laughs> we just jump off the ship. And then oh. I said, fuck it. I curse. So I was like, oh, wait, I can't curse. Can I? No, nah, it's fine. Oh, okay. <laughs> Take inventory of your food and water reserves. Okay. So we are completely lost. Yes, I said it earlier. Damn it. <laughs> there is no way of knowing how long we will be stranded. Cool. We just unloaded our supplies on Mars. I don't have much to survive on. Wait, why did we just unload our supplies on Mars? You should check out the refrigerator in the kitchen. Okay. All right. Yes, yeah, a trade ship, I guess. Please put on some clothes. <laughs> just like I guess it's like, but why <laughs> I'll <I'm> be naked <laughs> no let's not put on clothes journal updated no that's my inventory okay ooh I can't use this yet okay let's go to the fridge first then protein bar Yes, take it all. Water bottle. Uh, plus five health and 80 water. Okay. Coffee beans. The coffee machine uses this. What? Eat I can't beans. just eat them? <laughs> just eat the beans. Can't use this yet. I can't use this yet. I can't. But I have the beans. You don't have a cup or power. What is this moving down here? Robot? Oh, it is a robot. A cleaning robot. Uh, well, you don't need power to make stuff. What are you talking about? I guess we're supposed to put on clothes, but like... You should have them in your inventory already. Oh, right. You're right. Uh, clothes storage. Magnetic boots. Unequip? What? Oh, you have those on. That's the one thing you have on. Oh. Oh, you're going to slide around now. No. Okay. Equip. Do I have to hold this? Uh, you have to put on your suit first, I think. Oh. Equip, equip, equip. Equip. It's not letting me equip. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm actually not sure if you should have your helmet on, but I, I don't know. Crowbar, hammer. Am I only supposed to have my helmet on, like, in For, space? When need, yeah, we need air. Okay. Uh, I don't want to put it in the chest. I just want to unequip. Okay. All right, I already took everything. Advanced parts, construction parts. I don't think I need that. This is just storage. Nothing in the storage. Okay. But I can't clean this up. Okay. Go back to the command deck. Okay. We put on clothes, lady. Are you happy? Now that you have checked for sustenance, the logical next step would be for me to enable some crafting recipes that would boost your survival chances. But there is an inhibitor present to prevent it. Oh, you would need to remove this inhibitor in the engine room. Engine room. Why do you have an emergency protocol when you are still not free to help me? Yeah, lady. Corporation policies, I'm afraid. So they're just gonna watch us die. I hope I don't get into trouble for doing this. 
Please remove the inhibitor. I mean, my question is, is it an AI inhibitor? Is the AI going to take over? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I'm like, AI? Uh, check the computer in my room and then go to the inhibitor. Okay. Let's check out the codex. Oh, Fahrenheit, please. Oh, you got XP for that. Cool. Oh, wow. Okay. Radiation environment. Um, when you go higher radiation. Okay, radioactive. Accumulated too much radiation. I'll start to lose health. Okay, oxygen. Oh, whoops. Whoops. Oxygen. Uh... Oh, okay, scroll down with arrow. Gotcha. No oxygen. The status effects. Okay, wow, there's a lot of status assistances. I'm overwhelmed. Okay, crafting. I'm sure they'll come up only one at a time. I don't know. That's okay. Plus, you got a bunch of meters in the bottom left. Oh, that's how I... Okay, okay. I was trying to figure out how to move on to the next, like, section. I had to right-click. Oh, yeah, it's like... That's like RPG Maker's weird flow where, like, you, like, get locked... You get, like, locked into a menu and you have to back out of it. Yeah, uh, so I was like, how do I... <laughs> Please. Uh, crafting, processing... So it's, like, refining a 3D printer... Crafts parts with refined material and a stove prepare, uh, prepares a wide variety of dishes. So stove food, 3D printer parts, computer refined parts or things, temperature scales. So it's cold. Okay. How to save your progress. You can save your progress at the computer station. Blah, blah. Refueling the ship. Keep an eye out for your ship's fuel and oxygen. To refuel each, you will need oxygen or hydrogen. To refuel each resource, you need a full canister in your inventory. Then interact with the respective fuel ports. Fill oxygen. Okay. Space watch is a neat piece of technology. Oh. Oh. No. I don't like the system. I don't know how to use this little. Okay. Here. Okay. It'll automatically count a 24 hour cycle calculated on the planet size and rotation speed. Oh, wow. It actually changes based on the planet, huh? Hmm. Okay. Survival bars. It's the different stuff I need. Like the Sims. You need to potty and take a shower and whatnot. <laughs> the higher your environment radiation, the faster your metabolism, the hotter your environment, the quicker you dehydrate, the colder your environment, the faster you become tired. Okay. Oh, and this is where my journal is. Woke up today with backup power engaged. The weirdest thing has happened. As it turns out, en route to Mars, the ship seems to have gone through an anomalous region of space and left our solar system. I have no clue how this is even possible, traversing untold light years in such short time. I can only explain it as a wormhole in space-time. Its existence has been theorized long ago. Maybe I have unknowingly discovered one. Who even knows if I'm still in the same time? Oh, no. Whoa. Ooh, this is Twilight this is Zone. to Mars doesn't mean en route from Mars, because she said she already went to Mars. Oh, yeah. Good point. Right? Is that what it said? Oh, resume game. Uh, at the top an en route to Mars yeah there's a number of small mm. uh, grammar things you're going to want to get an editor because they're all too nitpicky to bother talking about 
Mm, mm, okay. So the engine room. Was that... Or is that... I'm not stepping into space. Why not? Is this the engine room? I think the arrow is pointing you to it. What? But then it's pointing this way. Yeah, but watch. Oh, what the heck? That's like hidden to me. What did you press? Oh, I see you opened it. Okay. Yes, go down. Okay, pull out the inhibitor. Check the space computer. Ooh, ooh. Let's check this out. 50% hydrogen, fuel remaining, 64 oxygen remaining. Ooh, XP. I think you can run by pressing shift, by the way. Oh, okay. Artificial intelligence interface. What would you like to do? So it is AI. Check intelligence. Oh, no. AI capped at 75%. Oh, God. Yes, yes. Check hardware. I think this ship is what I'm looking for. Go back to the command. Oh, no. Oh, no. She's going to take over. Oh, whoops. That's not what I wanted. You said shift? Oh, I guess so. Okay. Yes, let's go back up. <laughs> Let me in, lady. I've done what you told me. Okay, I have access to more data. Since, it, since this can be classified as an emergency, I'm allowed to enable some recipes for the 3D printer. Cool. But it seemed that you were not really allowed to... Dot, dot, dot. Oh, no. Next logical step would be to secure a good amount of water as soon as possible. I've located an asteroid close by in orbit around the star. Fly the ship to the asteroid and land on the dark side. Fly on the dark side? Oh, know. ice, I see. Yeah. That's where there will be most likely to be ice on the surface. Be sure not to linger too long, as your basic suit is not made for those extreme temperatures. So why are you even sending me there? You have no choice. Ah, we're gonna die. Okay, so... I... Oh, okay. Oh! Vroom, vroom. Oh my god! Uh... Okay, so... Do... Oh? Do I just... Shift? Oh... Oh... Am I supposed to get on this asteroid? Oh! I think so. <laughs> Oh, man, kaboom. What? On the dark side of the asteroid? What? Uh, I think just get close to it. I am close to it. I'm on top of it. Uh, press space, space maybe? Oh, okay. oh, there we go. Yeah. Land. Start seeing. Uh, oh, I see. This is hell. Okay. Oh, okay. Blah, blah. Ah. <laughs> I felt like I was about to make a life land. <laughs> uh, you will probably need a hammer to break the ice. Okay. I have a hammer. No, go back. I have a hammer. What? Do you? It's in my pocket. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Please go back. I have a hammer. Go mine ice on the asteroid surface. Oh, it's telling me to like go out into space. Oh, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Into the space. Into space. So I need this now. Yeah. And I have this equipped. Okay, cool. Let's go to space, baby. Jay opens up your test journal. Okay. Yeah, it's just a load screen, but. It's very cold here. It's very cold here. Negative 459 degrees Fahrenheit. My God. Okay. I think it's absolute zero. So do I just like go to this rock? Oh God, you're so thirsty. Uh, uh, do I press space? Uh, no. I think you need to turn on your flashlight. Um... 
my flashlight. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure what the ice will look like, but maybe it'll be this ice blue. Oh, oh, there you go. Okay, cool. Yeah, take that Bam. ice. Take that. Oh, oh, we can run. Right, 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 right. Give me the ice. All your ice belong to me. Yeah, I gotta make all the drinks. <laughs> Get drunk. I don't oh, have no. no room for this. Okay. Where? Oh. What? Is that inventory separate and I can't see it? Maybe. Hmm. Okay. Uh, that's weird. You're getting thirsty. I'm so thirsty. I guess I should probably drink some of this in my... In here. Drink whole bottles of water. Just go, go, go. Oh, wow, oh, that's wow. one? Holy shit. Wow, that's really hydrating. That's super water. I appreciate that. Go to engineering and use the processor to melt some water from the ice. Okay. Uh. Here. Here. I can use this machine now. Okay. Oh. Uh, is this? Yes. Ice. Crap. Max? Okay, cool. And then... Do I just leave the window? Oh. Uh. So I need to... What? Am I done? No. Yeah, you, you need like flasks or something. Empty says. bottles? I have empty oxygen bottles and I have empty bottles. Oh, here's the ice. 200. Then, um, what's this do? Empty canister? What? Uh... Okay. Uh. Uh. <laughs> it says you need a flask. I don't know how you get flasks. Ice. Ice, ice, baby. Input ice. Empty flask. How to flask. Yeah, was there anything in the other one? Okay. Products, empty canister, not a flask. Uh, hmm. Oh, it says to craft the canister in their uh, objectives. Uh, okay. Empty canister, I need iron and construction parts. Oh, shit. Construction well, I parts. Just, oh, I, I see. Iron. They just want you to melt the ice right now. They don't want you to. Yeah. But. Oh, you can't do that without a flask? Yeah, that's what I'm like. What do you mean? Iron. Do I need to go back out there and get iron from somewhere? I guess so. Like, I only saw ice. You're getting a little hungry. Oh, God. Uh, by the way, you can move things onto your, uh... Oh, I see that uh, now. Uh, yeah. yeah. Take I that. Need to put your tools on there. No, why? Or why? Oh, I can't. I thought you... Hmm. Really? So why was it... Huh. No, I can't. Oh. That's weird. Um, I think you can hover over them and just press the number you want. Number three. Oh. Number four. Number five. Tablet. Oh, I just checked my pistols. Okay. 
Oh, it auto-puts your helmet on. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Okay, I don't have to worry about that then. It's very, it's cold. very cold out here. It's so cold. They don't like it. She I need a drill for this. Uh-oh. Um. Okay, that one doesn't give me anything. Um, up here. Oh God, a second area. Yeah, I like. Well, there's a bunch of ice everywhere. Yeah, maybe there's uh more stuff in your ship. I'm just realizing like. I feel like you're going to have to make a drill to get the stuff, and you can't even do that. Yeah. Hmm. I thought I checked everything, though. Run, 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 run. Run, run. Get back inside. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the airlock. I can't really hear the thing for that. Oh, I think I know what happened here. So I think these lockers down here have two sides to them. Oh, I see. No, nothing uh -oh. here. Advanced parts, construction parts. I don't think I need that. I don't think I need that. Nothing here. Oh, advanced parts, right? Construction parts, right? I didn't get that last time. I left them in here. Right. No. Bottled oxygen. Okay. And then. These don't have anything. Oh, these are things too? Wow. Yeah, they're just like storage boxes. Why is it doing that? Whoops. Okay. Alright. Uh, do those parts, the new parts you got, does that let you craft the canister? Construction parts, advanced parts. Um, good question. Parts, uh, products, empty canister. Oh, you still need iron. Hmm. Still need iron. Oh, go to tools, I guess. Sir, can you make the drill that I was talking about? Um. No, nothing's oh. coming up. Hmm. 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 Oh, iron. I feel bamboozled. Oh, no. Can I go in here? Oh, what's in here? Oh. Uh, okay. Okay. I make no. I don't know why it's going up so high. Whoa. Oh, it's going up by ten or I think it's going up by ten. Yeah. Why? Five. Crap. Pink instant. Pink. All right. Is it in my right there? Okay. Cool. Man, I was right next to us the whole time. <laughs> Keep an eye on your water reserves as it, it is the fluid of life after all. Got it. You will also need to grow your own food inside the ship. Ah, how will I do that? The storage area on the ship can be retrofitted for this purpose. 
You can transform the storage containers into something resembling a planter by breaking open the lid on top. You will need to add dirt in each planter. Dirt can be made in the processor. You will need to find the raw materials on this asteroid, as the ship was never intended to land on planets or any body with atmosphere. I also unlocked a recipe for a drill. Okay, cool. Oh, that sounds super dangerous if it's not intended to land on planets. Yeah, like, what are we doing here? <laughs> you can check storage for the materials needed to craft the drill. Sorry, that period right there, like, made me go through a little yeah, like, roll there. Like, capitalized. Yeah, it's just, I, I guess it's capitalized because it's like a specific item that they're telling you, right? But the period, I was like, what? why is it period? Come talk to me when you retrofitted the cargo bay and prepared all the containers. Smashy, smashy. Smash all the things. It says use a crowbar. Yeah, you already got a crowbar. Yeah. Wait, is it talking about, what are these? Oh, these. I was thinking about the other uh, four. Yeah. Yeah. Destroy everything. Kapow. Destroy that. Gather ingredients mix to mix the dirt. Should I try? I guess I don't yeah, let's have. Find out what it wants to. For the, do the drill. For dirt? Oh, and dirt. I guess. Mixing dirt. I need gravel and sand. Okay. We have a shovel. How do we get those things? Uh, good question. Probably a drill. Oh, maybe. Yeah. So how do I make a drill? Tools, right? Drill. Oh, oh okay. I can make this one. Is... Cool. Yeah. That's awesome. What those parts are for. I don't think I need that. Perfect. So now I have a draw. Cool. Now let's see if we can get the stuff. <laughs> Go outside. You cannot wear a helmet without the suit. Okay. Very cold here. Gosh. I know, this is the billionth time you said that. Okay. Sandstone. Damn. But we need not sandstone. Yeah, I would say dirt uh dirt and gravel. Yeah, something like that. This is all stone. Oh stone, yeah. Stone. And gravel, I think. Uh there. Gravel. Where do I get gravel? It's not these itty bitty ones, no. No. This big rock? No. This ginormous rock. <laughs> Let's go up here. Just drill everything. Uh. I'm trying to drill everything. It won't work. Uh. Oh, my oxygen tank. <gasps> Can you just do that in here? Is that possible? You have uh, that one, right? Oxygen container. You used to refill oxygen. Oh, your ship. You need the one above it, I think. This one. Okay. Oh, whoop, there you go. I should probably get food and water while I'm in here. Oh, okay. it's cool. I didn't expect you to be able to do that with your spacesuit on. Yeah, that's pretty nifty. Don't have to worry about that. Ooh, a cave. I love caves. Oh, I'm sliding on the ice. Ooh. That's kind of cool. Oh, rocks. Oh, iron. Oh, iron. Iron. Um... 
not not gravel. Give me all your iron. Yeah, I wonder if the sandstone will just break into those two components. I don't have more room. Oh no. All oh right. god, run away. I mean, I guess I could check here. Stone. Sandstone. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> All right. Does something. Okay, maybe the sandstone can be processed into gravel? I don't know. I don't know how to do things. Ooh. Fucking running around. Yeah, meh, 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 meh. At least I don't have a stamina thing, I guess, because that's always annoying. Yeah, you just burn through oxygen faster, but that's fine. That's fine. <laughs> don't need to breathe. This, uh, this airlock needs a little more fanfare, I feel like. The, oh, this entrance over here? Like, yeah, more possessed? Yeah, because you're going through it, and it, like, pauses, and I'm not sure if you're... Like, does that make sense to you, that it's an airlock? It took me, like, the third time, because I didn't realize it was doing those, like, little, like, airflow wi wisps until, oh, yeah. like, that, that turn, and I was like, oh, I guess that's the airlock. Like, it's supposed to, like, I guess, I don't know, decontaminating you or whatever. Uh, pressurizing. Yeah, that sure. one. That one. Um. But decamination should probably be happening too. <laughs> <laughs> Third. Gravel. Oh, okay. Grind. So maybe in the grind. Okay. Oh, yeah, so the so stone puts out ten, something. Yeah, the stone puts out gravel. gravel. And sandstone gives you the other one? Sandstone gives me the other one. And dirt. Duh. Dirt. Dirt. I made dirt. Okay, wait, why was I making dirt? Add dirt to the... Con oh, right. <laughs> the planters. Uh, it's in my inventory, right? So. I think you just click on it. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I guess not. Oh, there we go. Go food in here. Wow. Whoa. I heard a cat come through the cat door with a lot of power. Yes. <laughs> Find seeds in the kitchen. Okay. Out of the way, little one. Uh oh, I can make coffee now. Craft the coffee. Uh seeding? Unpack? Package? Oh. A lot of water. Water can. What? Does water can have more water than bottled water? Not sure. Like there's no... No description to say what each thing does? Yeah. Yeah, like how do I... Uh, but I guess hmm. the seeds, maybe the seeds are in the... the yeah. fridge? Maybe. But I took everything out from the fridge. Oh, wait. Do you already have? No, those are coffee, coffee beans. Coffee beans. Right. Uh... Yeah, okay. Is it, like, here? Oh, I'm just sitting. Just having a seat. <laughs> Trash can? Um... Oh, see, sí, potato. Yes, give me potatoes. Oh, that's okay. I thought those were regular potatoes. Give me potato seed. Plant a seed. 
Can I just... Uh, can I put this in like here? No, I can't. Okay, so I have to do this every time? Ugh. Click, clack, click, clack. That's kind of annoying. <laughs> but I don't know, like, what the restrictions are on, like, RPG Maker to not have to do this. Yeah, I'm a little bit curious. I feel like... I don't know, I guess there could be like a tool and it would use uh, the item. I don't know. Because like, I can just use a drill, right? Like, I don't have to click a drill so I can't just plant the seed. The plant is still growing. Okay, oh. should I water them? Yeah, the mission says to go back to the command deck. And I guess okay. he's gonna, she's going to be like, water your plants. Okay. Now you should at least have food to survive a while. Oh. Hmm. Next step would be to create a farming outpost on a nearby planet. Why would I want that? Your survival chances will be much greater if you can make an outpost planet side. The ship will need some heat shielding depending on how strong the atmosphere is. Okay, she's so like, I guess, even though it's her, like, how she survives. <laughs> yeah. I'm detecting iron deposits on the light side of this asteroid. Land there to get the necessary resources for your task. Unless you want to keep digging in the ice. You already got the iron. Yeah, I did. So craft two heat shields for your ship. And I guess I should be crafting a canister. Mm, okay, but I don't have that stuff. Okay. And a heat shield requires iron and construction parts. Okay, so construction parts are iron. Okay, so I guess I have to go over here. I'm an iron. Give me all the iron craft. Cool. Uh, then go back here. We make construction parts. Uh, two. Okay, canister needs, okay, I need heat shield more. Did it say two? Yeah, two. Craft? I need more iron. Okay. Oh, well, it just says to install the heat shield on your ship. Oh, uh, before it said craft, so it changed. Yeah, you, you yeah. did the thing. Oh. Uh oh, what? Oh, was was I supposed to go somewhere else? Uh, oh, this is just telling you where you can get more iron. Oh, okay. Let's go. Ooh, beep, 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 beep. Right, okay. She's so passive aggressive. I know, like, she... You're trying to survive, right? <laughs> okay, so going to get iron. A helm or a helmet? I think it's a helm. Yeah. There's radiation here. Why would you send us to the place that has radiation? I could have just stayed at the other place that still had iron. Oh, yeah. My God. Okay. Oh. This, this is ice. There's like circles on your ship. Oh, there is. Oh, it's for the heat shields. Okay, 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 okay. Yes, install the heat shield. No. 
heat shield installed. Okay. Uh, what? Uh oh. Uh, I'm stuck. Uh oh. I'm stuck. <laughs> I think this game is auto saves. Ah. Can't like run or anything or. Okay. How did this happen? <laughs> oh, there it goes. Oh, you did it. <laughs> just brute force. I just brute force. I don't know how that happened. There must have been like a collision box that changed or something when you clicked on it. I don't know, but I just when in doubt, smash buttons. That's what I say. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I need like food. Okay. On water. More food. Oh, and it gives me energy. Okay. Um, excuse me, where do I go? Oh, you're looking for iron, right? Oh, can I go in here? This is iron. Okay. Oh, that is iron. I thought that was ice. Yeah, I thought it was ice too. But I guess the ice is more white. I'm tired. Okay. Stop being tired. Are we supposed to sleep somewhere? Yeah. Oh, whoops. All right. I'm just going to get this iron and max out the iron. Nah, that's enough. I'm tired. Okay. We're going. We're getting in there. Please just make it to the ship. I'm tired. I need my sleep. Yeah, there should be more than just this little swish, 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 maybe. I don't know. Maybe my sound on the game is too low. Yeah, but I feel like I can hear certain things. Yeah. Yeah, I can hear the text beeps, but I can't hear... Like the ambiance. Yeah. Um. Oh, they are growing. I... Okay. Thought we were gonna have to like add water or something. You must sleep. You're so slow. Says go talk to your AI. What does she want? Or he want? I guess. Now you will be able to land on low atmosphere planets. Okay. I've located a planet close by. Land on the designated landing zone. Okay. She's so like <laughs> just apathetic. Just like okay, whatever. I guess. Okay. I guess that's what I'll do. Uh, how do I fly this again? You need to yeah. sleep. Oh, sleep? What sleep? You can't operate heavy machinery while sleepy? Yeah, I can. It just won't be good. Murder everybody. She's naked again! Excuse me, lady. <laughs> oh, she could finally clean it up? <laughs> Why? What changed? Oh, I put this in the locker. Whoops. Put it on. Okay. Put your clothes on. Uh, and then we're going to go to the planet. I at least want to see the planet, I guess. Yeah. Uh, this isn't telling me where to go. Oh, fly space ship to space. Okay. This is still not telling me where to go. Uh oh, there it is. Know. There it is. Is it is that the planet? It looks like a little cheese bowl. Oh. Oh god, the sun is a red giant. Whoa. Are we or landing on the light side? The dark side? Does it matter? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, maybe it's a dwarf. Yeah, yeah. I've located a good spot to build a farming outpost. All right. <laughs> You will be able to grow more crops on a planet. All right, then. <laughs> yeah, she doesn't need to respond to everything. She could just... Yeah. 
Like, she, it just makes her seem like she's so annoyed and she's just over it and just like, whatever. Like, leave it, leave it alone. Uh, I guess I want to check out the, what the planet looks like. Almost all objects are interactable. Okay. Saving. How are you supposed to build a farming outpost? Okay, so this is just like more material stuff out here. Where is it telling you where it's telling oh, you? Oh, right here. Go, but... Right here. I don't know how this is supposed to work. This looks like a good place for an outpost. Build farming outpost here. Yes. What? How? Oh, okay. I need a base beacon. So, does that mean I have to go figure out how to build a base beacon? Is it now a recipe? Build a giant ass base on this little thingy. This big ass base for myself. Um, hmm. You. Products? Base beacon. I need more construction parts. Okay, so that means I gotta do iron. Refinement, iron. All the iron craft. Okay. And construction parts, too. Craft. Base beacon. Craft. While we're in here, it says to build a canister, which we can do. Cool. Okay. Build a farming outpost. Okay, let's go. What? I'm stuck. Gathering resources lowers your energy. Okay. And then... What? What's that beeping? Oh, my oxygen tank again. Uh... Boop. Yes. Yes. Okay. Build the f yes. Need oh, resources. bamboozled! You gotta go back and build more things. Oh God! Oh, now the time <laughs> actually works. I was looking at it and like, yeah, it didn't I seem like it ever moved. But I guess there's no time on an asteroid. I don't know. Yeah, I think it's just because yeah, planet based. Planet based. Uh, foundation. I need oh, tons wow. of stone. Wow. Okay. Um, hmm. Probably need to do something about more water first, because I only have, like, one bottle left. Yeah, how do you bottle water? Is there a... Uh, I think I have to, like... Oh, I should Boxing. refill this. Oh, no, I can't. Just one. Okay. Electrosis. This is water. Empty canister. Okay. And how do you make a water bottle out of that? Uh, water flask can be poured out into smaller bottles. Is it here? No, no, obviously not. Maybe it is here. Cleaning, uh, mixing, environment, electric. Uh. Uh. Oh, I think it's in the kitchen, actually. I think I remember seeing something. I don't... Get, get out of my way. Oh, it's in the sink. Uh, okay, so what is the difference between a water can... And a bottle of water. And I need 
an empty bottle. Oh. You know what? I'm just going to make a water can and see what it does. Water can used in preparation of meals. Oh, no. Oh, but you can drink it, it looks like. I can. I can drink it. I'm going to drink this last bottle. Now I have five empty. And now I can do this. Okay. All right, I can do that. Cooking. Can I cook anything yet? No. Package. Potato seeds. Unpack. Potato seeds. Okay. Robot. Robot. Okay, probably have to wait for those seeds. They're those potatoes to grow. Yes. See, it's in my way. I can't get out now. Oh, no. Come on, robot. Come on. Uh, all right, we'll just sit and wait. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Have a steak, as the mm -hmm, icon suggests. Mm -hmm. What? You're hungry. Oh, I am hungry. Let's have dinner at the table. Oh, he finally moved. Oh, there's a little crossed, I crossed like utensils icon over there. Can you mouse over those icons on the bottom left? Do they tell you what they do? Bottom left. No. Oh, damn. Yeah, I guess because you were eating at a table. I don't know if it made it better or something. Hmm. That'd be interesting. Should I water these? Like, I feel like water. Oh, it just like took a whole bottle of my water. Jeez. Okay, I don't want to do that. Uh, so I need to get raw. Um. Maybe I'll just build this outpost and call it. Let's yeah. see. I think that's. See what the outpost is about. Yeah. Uh, six. Stone. 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 What's this? Quartz. Oh, quartz. Okay. How much stone? I guess I should just max stone out. Do the sizes matter? No, it's just random. What a bamboozle. What are these? Two beans. Two beans. Two beans. Click. Okay. More stone. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's no radiation going on right now. There. There's some more stone stones to murder. Here? Murder stone. Take that. Oh no. It's windy. Something's happening. Oh, it's tiny nighttime. Oh no. Can't get cold. Yeah, what's that gonna do to the uh thirty-two degrees Fahrenheit now? That's okay, I don't have more room. Okay, let's go back. It's too cold out here. I mean, considering you were on a planet that was absolute zero for an <laughs> asteroid. That's true. Like, 32 degrees is nothing. It's no big thing. Okay, and so... No, get out of my way. I don't remember how much stone it wanted us to make. Uh, I think it said five, but like, you would uh -oh. make five by making it once. 
Oh, I made two. So, mm. okay. I don't like this here. Yeah, the collision boxes are a little bit sticky. Like, put it on this side, I guess. Oh, 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 on the other side. The hotter your environment, the quicker you dehydrate. Okay. Yes. Whoa. Okay. No power. No power. No power. No oh my power. God. Okay. Do you tell me more? Farming plots. Soil. Okay. So I'm assuming this is just going to become like farming plots. Like what's inside. I think some of this building is too much, too many steps. Yeah, it does feel like, uh, it kind of feels more like it's just you're going along an upgrade path the whole time rather than like a freeform thing. But I assume that, you know, at some point you get to more creative aspect, like you're done going through the tutorial. Yeah. I just feel like, I don't know. I guess I'm just like having to collect all this stuff. Like, it, 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 I think for me, it's that I have to like build it first before I know what else to get. Where I wish I could just know like the next, I don't know, two or three things that I need so I can do it all at once instead of the constant back and forth. Yeah, that's true. I feel like most crafting games give you some way of doing that like the codex is on you and like you can know yeah like i guess yeah let's see i mean Wait, here you have to like no this is just like no this is just telling us like what everything is right yeah yeah oh save oh okay like, I saved a little ago. Okay. I think I've gotten a general feel for it. All right, let's move on to the scoring then. Uh, so, as you can see, it's out of 10. Uh, okay. We tend to give games that just have, like, the basic default stuff, uh, which is called RTP. We tend to usually give that around a 2 out of 10. Okay. Or just, like, basically hitting the deploy button, you know? Mm-hmm. Um, but, yeah, the, uh, the out of 10 stuff is more like, I don't know, we try to be more, uh, I guess, objective. And then the overall impression is more subjective, like how we feel. So, and when we grade, we try to grade it against, like, all games out there. So you don't have to worry about, like, how this compares to other RPG Maker games, because that's, that's irrelevant. Okay. So, yeah. Um, we just kind of go through these, and we agree on a number for the uh, out of 10 part. But then the overall impression, we each get our own. Okay. Got it. Well, I don't really know, like, what is the default, I guess, because I don't really work with RPG Maker, right? So That's true. I can just tell you, this is not, this is not default gameplay, at least so far. We haven't seen any monsters. Oh, okay. Uh, how about, like, the art assets and all of that? Uh, the art assets, I think, are all a bunch of different stock stuff. I'm not sure, but they're definitely not... Um, I don't think I recall seeing any default stuff in this game. Okay, cool. So you can just kind of judge it with your heart, I guess. Mm hmm However you feel about it compared to other indie games out there. Right, right. 
I mean, for me, a big thing is always like I'm a very visual person, so I'm very like snobby when it comes to the art and stuff. Um, so a lot of the times I tend to stay away from like pixel light games because I'm just like, ugh, it's so old. It's just pixels. But um, this looked pretty nice. I thought it was nice. It was cute. Um, I did like some of the like lighting stuff that was in there. So. Yeah. Well, I don't think you have to worry about being a snob because uh, me and Tony are usually like major haters. So I've heard, I've heard some of your hating. It's amusing. I guess I'm not that much of a hater. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah. Um, but we normally start with gameplay. That's why you put it on the left first. Okay. So I don't know. How did you, how did you feel about this compared to like, uh, other survival games and stuff, you can kind of have a basis there. I guess uh, we generally use five as like um, average, I guess. Like if it's mm -hmm. comparable to a real, a real quote unquote game. <laughs> gotcha. Okay. Um, I guess I might say a four. Uh, it's like for an indie survival game, I think it's not bad but i think that there's just for some of the stuff it was just way too many like steps back and forth for my type of gameplay i don't like it as much having to like constantly do the back and forth and feeling like um there's i guess there's just too many steps when i'd rather just kind of know what the process is going to be right away so i can just like boom 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 gather everything and then get it done but it might just be because it's the tutorial phase. So it's very like step by step oriented. So. Yeah. Uh, I guess my feeling is uh, maybe they, I don't know, at this, you've certainly gotten to a point where like, I mean, how much tutorial do you need to know? Like, use the thing to build things. Like, we've got it by this point. That's true. I'm like waiting for like more exciting stuff to happen, I guess. So I think four, I think is fair if you want to put that in there. Okay. Because I think there's there's some sort oh. of excitement thing that's missing. Yeah, yeah, definitely. There's definitely way too much setup time for me. All right, so narrative. Um, so we're I'd like to think we're pretty generous about this. Obviously, this, obviously this game isn't very story heavy, but you know, narrative also covers like immersion and like. Mm -hmm. Um, kind of explaining what buttons do and why, um, which I think this game did a pretty good job of that, making it so it's like, like what you're crafting and why kind of has a story of like you're making, you need to break the ice to make water, and you need water to drink. Yeah, it definitely did a good job of that. Um, uh, I think the only part where I was kind of like, uh. I think that's how it works is when we were trying to get like the sand and the gravel because it wasn't just a material that we could just pick up. We had to like actually go and break it down. And I guess I didn't put two into for that too very like quickly. So, but otherwise, yeah, it was pretty straightforward. Yeah, I think it was fine. I think my main complaint would just be like a little too much back and forth with the computer. In terms mm -hmm. of the dialogue like i get that it's supposed to be very like uh matter of fact and not like have a lot of fluff but like and you know we mentioned like the character seems kind of passive aggressive and complaining i feel like that's not yeah intended. yeah so yeah kinda... oh sorry no i was just gonna say yeah like it was ha having the character constantly be like okay all right, like it made her come like she's really apathetic and she's just like, why am I even doing this? I just want to die. Like, <laughs> what is happening? Yeah. So, I mean, I might be, I don't know, maybe a 4.5 or a 5 or something. Yeah, I'd say a 5 is fine. Okay. Yeah, because it wasn't like bad either. It was amusing to, to have take it in that way. As opposed to, it's probably not the way they intended, right? But I took it that way and it made it amusing. Yeah, I kind of think that's a pretty good selling point for me. I definitely thought, like, the space stuff is cool. Yeah. Where it's like, 
go to the cold side of the asteroid and it's absolute zero. It's like, oh God, science things. Yeah, it's definitely a difference compared to like all the zombie games out there, all the like world ending events that you're surviving type of survival games. So. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I, was, I forget I'm supposed to type it. Five. Yeah, you there type. We go. I type. <laughs> uh, audio. Um, I mean, I guess we had it pretty quiet, but uh, I don't know. I kind of was, kind of felt like certain things needed a bit more punch to them, I guess, and a little more like, I don't know. Um, like the dynamics seemed like they're off. Like I could hear like the text crawl, but I couldn't hear like the airlock. Yeah, some of them, some of it did need a little bit of work, but I, in general, thought it was, it wasn't obnoxious either, which can happen sometimes, right? So. Yes. <laughs> so I thought it did pretty all right. Yeah, I'd probably, I don't know, maybe like a four or five or something. I'll say a five. Oh, okay. Visuals, uh, maybe I'll let you talk about this one. Visuals. Yeah, like I was saying earlier, like I'm a snob when it comes to that, but like this was really cute. Like it had some really good lighting in there and everything looked like it belonged together. It didn't look like there were mismatched pieces put together to try and make like a game. It all looked like it belonged, right? Like it was... The theme was the same, like they did a good job at making everything be cohesive in their art. So Yeah. I think the main the only thing I really questioned was uh why 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 is your character naked? Although I guess maybe that's more of a narrative thing. <laughs> Listen, you will not shame her for just wanting to be naked, okay? Listen, <laughs> some people just want to be naked all the time. I'm sure if she didn't have to wear a suit to survive, she'd just be, like, free-balling it all day long. <laughs> yes. Um, other than that, I guess maybe the AI looked a little stretched out, but yeah, I think it looked pretty good. Yeah, I think it did pretty good. Uh, I will... You know... I'll do a five. So mapping, this is where things get a little bit redundant, but uh, we tend to want to comment on this because it comes up a lot in like RPG Maker forums and stuff. People mm -hmm. are very into their level design and stuff. Uh, but yeah, this has more to do with like the actual levels and like, do they look like places? Are they fun to explore? Uh, collision, I guess. Mm -hmm. I know you had some struggles with the collision and things being tight. I did. Uh, that was, and you know, and then I got stuck and I panicked and I finally got out somehow by magic. Don't know what happened there. And like, I'm just thinking, I guess, mapping in comparison to something like, um, oh my gosh, what is, why can't I remember the name of the farming game that everybody plays? That's also pixel art. Oh, Stardew Valley. Yeah. Stardew Valley. Like, for I was kind of comparing it to that while I was playing there. And, like, this one just seemed a little bit, like, less um, fun to look at. Right? Yeah. And then, like, I don't... It was kind of... I at first thought, like, the iron was also ice because it kind of looked like ice, too. But I don't know. It's, a, it's just, like, some of the mapping stuff definitely could have used work for me. There was too much empty space. And then, like, we still had to go to another area to collect more stuff. It seemed like it was too big or not enough stuff on there. Yeah, it's hard to, uh, hard to judge with a game like this because... Yeah. I mean, they've kind of put themselves in a corner here by having uninhabited barren planets. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's true. Um, but I thought it was functional. I guess it looked okay, so. Oh, yeah, it definitely wasn't, like, terrible. I wasn't like, what is this? <laughs> so I might be at, like, a four again. <laughs> yeah, I can agree with that one. Because I had too much trouble with, like, 
um, collision. Yeah. All right. Well, technical is uh, has to do with like bugs and like performance and uh, just if there's any cool tech stuff that they tried. Mm-hmm. Um, which they did some, but you kind of don't. It's kind of hard because we're judging against all games, right? And by default, RPG Maker is very plug and play. So, um, so there were a couple things they did, but you know, in order to be a five, you'd probably have to like. I don't know, rebuild the engine just about. Because, I don't know, that's kind of what you do with other engines. You have to build your own thing. And this kind of, it, it kind of got close to that, but um, I mostly think about, like, uh, stuff like, it, it felt like it had pixel movement. I'm not sure if you felt like you were stuck on a grid. No, I definitely felt like I could kind of go wherever I wanted. So... Okay, so there's that, and then there's like, you know, the UI work, they added the buttons, and they have uh, the gathering stuff. They built a lot of things that aren't, like, default in RPG Maker. Um, so, I mean, there were some typos, though, and uh, you got stuck in that one spot. So, I don't know, I'd probably give it another <laughs> another four, probably. Um. Yeah, I guess I can't really say too much, because I don't know too much of the technical side on that. So I'm going to go with what you're saying, a four. <laughs> yeah. So value is hard because normally we have a price to judge this off of, but I don't, I don't know what the price of this game is. So I think I would assume this is probably going to be like $10, but I don't know. Some RPG Maker devs are bold and they're like $20. Oh no, this would not be worth $20. <laughs> <laughs> all right so let's assume it's ten dollars um and i guess we don't really know how much i'll maybe i'll pull it up and i'll see if i can look up if it's how much gameplay time there is oh it doesn't tell me so i have no idea how much gameplay there is but man the opening's kind of slow so i'd hope that there's a lot more yeah like it felt like we didn't really get to the part where the, the point where the game opens up so I don't know. So assuming it's a $10 game, I'd probably say it's <laughs> another, I don't know, maybe it's a three. I don't know. I think I would have to agree with you because it just, mm, yeah, it's not meeting that like value aspect. And if there isn't much more, like, I think that the downfall here is that we don't know how much like gameplay in general there is. So we can't like give a proper um comparison as to how long it took us to get through like that first part to start getting into the actual stuff like yeah. the meat of the game so i'll agree with the three okie dokie all right so uh now we get an overall impression which we do as a grading from s all the way down to f which is pretty funny because if uh we tend to give a lot of D's and C's and F's. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine. <laughs> um, so, uh, do you do you have a, a, a letter grade in your mind that you would use for this? I would give it like a D plus. Oh wow. <laughs> Yeah, because I thought it was really cute. And like, I think for me, it's just like the visual part. I thought it was really well done for it being like a little small. Like, is it just one person working on this? Probably. Yeah. So like, I thought it was really well done just for one person. And but, you know, I don't I don't also know like what you can or can't do on with the RPG maker. So I guess I'm being kind of nice or you know easy on that i mean that's the thing though we're we always approach this as just like what a customer thinks i guess and what we feel about buying a game it's not really about like oh how impressive it is that you built this thing out of rpg maker because it's a jank engine so yeah so then yeah like i would say with the d plus because i definitely 
can feel like I wanted to keep playing more, but my downfall on that was like, there's too much back and forth and I was starting to get bored. So it's just like, ugh. Okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> um, I guess, I guess, uh, mm, I'm going to give it a D plus plus. How about that? Oh, snap. Yeah. We, we're kind of, uh, we're kind of funny with our, we have plus plus and we also have plus minus. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, it's just it's, in the middle. Yeah. It's in the middle. <laughs> so isn't it just a D? <laughs> like, <laughs> no, it's like a, like if a D plus, like if a D is like, uh, say it's a six, right? Out of 10 or something. Oh, wait, that would be like school, right? Uh, the letter is like in the middle and then like plus is like 0.5 and then like plus minus would be uh, 0.25. <laughs> okay. Okay. Sure. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> so something like that. Okay. So then I do D plus D plus plus. Right? Yeah. Oh, are we gonna what suggested price do we have? Are we just gonna say ten dollars is fine? Or what do you think? Would be five? I'd say five. Okay. Uh, yeah, and I guess our time played is around an hour. I, at, when I first, when we first started doing this, I would actually put the actual time, but I don't, I don't care anymore. I just put like around an hour. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually down to the second, but now you're just like, eh, whatever It's like an hour, one yeah. hour. And the notes, uh, kind of, we kind of just leave these so we can, I guess, remember what game is, which we might say about this. Uh, there we go. Too much back and forth. Yeah. All right, I think uh, I think that's uh, that was a pretty good first outing for you. How did you How do you feel? Do you have anything more to say? Uh, no, no, that was pretty fun. Um, yeah, I look forward to doing more of these. Maybe I'll get more like in th like the zone or like the idea of how to actually like because I was just kind of playing it. I wasn't necessarily judging it too much, and maybe I need to do that more as part of your guys's overall way of doing things. Is it trash? <laughs> is it trash? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I thought it was pretty good. I thought you good, did a good job. Maybe I'm biased. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah. So I guess we'll just wrap things up here and uh, see you guys next time.